test, test. Hey everybody, this is Jack to Place. Um, this is an sculpt video, I think. It's going to be a sculpt video. Um, it's not a tutorial, it's not anything like uh, I want to say or something, or um, no reveal trailers, no trailers. This is just like a sculpt trailer, so um, I'm not sure if I'm going to do it speed eventually in like in the, on YouTube that I will like speed draw that, that, that like it's like in a time lapse um, I don't think I will do that I just do it just like so you can see how I'm sculpting I think that's the best way to do sometimes when you want to learn some techniques um, and to be honest like I'm going to sculpt something I'm basically all my sculpts are new so I've never like experienced much of my sculpts before in dreams definitely not in dreams um, so, yeah, you're probably going to see me sometimes, like, making stuff and then, like, maybe redo it or deleting stuff and then redo, and redo it again or then, so, I don't know how long this video is going to be. I really, I'm trying to aim for at least an hour with the sculpt. Um, if it's going to be longer, then it's going to be longer, but, uh, let, let's see how far, how, how far we can get. And I know I can talk a lot, so, um... Okay, so we start fresh uh, with a new element. So we're going to click that one. And there's a thing that I'm going to make. I'm going to make a Japanese roof. And if you do not know what that means, like you have sometimes, um, like if you go uh, to Japan or in China, China also have like very the same, almost the same structures. Uh, but if you go to Japan and you look at those temples or uh, bri not bridges, but like more of like t temples and um, houses, dojos. They have like certain rooftops. And at the moment that I'm recording this, I'm also working on uh, Aria the Boot uh, for Dreamscom 2021. 20, uh, and um, I'm not sure when I'm going to upload this, uh, or Dreamscom is already. Uh, been gone or it's still going to take place when you're watching this but at least that's like um, what I'm building it for and and I'm also doing it for the Aria the game so it's a little bit of win-win situation <laughs> um, because like I've already sculpted a Japanese room a, a decent Japanese roof before um, I did like do some um, some rooftops uh, from like gates and dojos and stuff like that already in dreams, but not really this not the, the one that I'm going to create right now. All right, so um, I Do have like I'm not like doing it completely out of my head because like I have searched on Google um, Some reference pictures um, and I combine them all together. I'm not going to recreate them one-on-one -on -one. I really want to give a little bit of my own um yeah, my own taste and my own, uh, how do you say that, my own style in it, because like it also need to fit eventually in the game Aria. So uh, I'm probably going to make more rooftops eventually, because like uh, the more different types of rooftops you have, the more vibrant world you can create. So um, yeah, that will be a lot of challenge as well for me. But um, yeah, I'm I'm not going walk away with any but, but, with, um, on any challenge. So uh, this is definitely a challenge for me. Okay, before I'm starting, I always go to the show height and I will um, deselect the hover effect. I always hate that for some reason. Um, so I don't have, so I don't have that one. Um, okay, and with this one because like it's a rooftop. I really wanted to create like a, a mirror mode. So if you have like, um, like a, a, make an, an object that is like on both sides exactly the same as the other side, then it's really easier to do that if you're going into mirror mode. So that we have, we have to do the, uh, something like that. So I'm putting my grid snap on. Um, I'm not really sure. Is there is there already a ruler in dreams that we have? I don't think so, right? Don't really have rulers in here. Oh, um, so no. Um, at least not that I'm aware of. But like the thing is, like with um, I need to know like what kind of size the rooftop is going to be. So uh, the easiest way to do that is I always pick up like the blank puppet, 
as my default um, one on one creation. So I'm always stamping a puppet into my scene. Every time when I'm sculpting assets uh, for uh, ARIA or any other projects that I'm doing, um, I always put a uh, puppet into my scene. And I will show you really quickly why I'm doing that. Like if you're going, if I'm going to my creations really quickly, like for instance, we have here a frying pan with axe. It's actually one on one skill. So you don't have to. Um, you can of course do it, but you don't have to resize the object. So I often sculpt um, sculpt things on real life sizes. Um, just, just it, it's easier to do that. Like let's so like here we have some oriental street light. Um, also, I'm sculpt I sculpted this on stream. And this is a pretty tall one. So this is an actually like this is the size. Um, that it's going to be like it's a very tall one, um, so it's not going to be like this, like this, like something like <laughs> like a very small one. Now this is actually going to be the real life uh, size uh, street light, and like you're often seeing them like doing like this, and then very often, uh, yeah. So that's why I always put a puppet into my scene, so I know if I sculpt something, I know in what size I have to go for. Now, a rooftop. Now, this is of course like depends on like how tall and large and broad the the building itself is. But I think I have like already a little bit of an idea. So let's start with a little bit of a sketch. So I'm going to uh, always I just always start with a cube. Not always, but uh, in, in, the, in this matter, <laughs> I'm starting with a cube and I'm just like placing it like down, and then I'm going to scope in again. So I scope out and then scope in again. And then I'm going to hit the mirror modes. So we have like now two sides of the cubes and then I place it again as well. And then I remove the middle part. The reason why I'm doing it in this way and not in, I will also show you the, what happens when you're not doing this. Like now, like if you want to so like select uh, a cube, right? And also like put it on mirror and I stamp it in here. Now we already have a extra sculpt inside of this, right? And you can of course delete that one as well. Like it's not like a big of a deal, but like I, I, it can happen that you sometimes forget that because like I don't know, like I'm not sure if it's like too much heavier in the, in the Dreams engine or something like that. So I, I do not know that. But like um, yeah, for the sake of it, I know, I always do start with one cube and then put on the mirror mode on. I don't know why that is. Maybe it's very silly of me. Uh, maybe it doesn't really not doing much extra um, resources. Um, but yeah, that's how I do it. So, and now we're going to close the GIS gap down. So we actually have a, um, yeah, a nice block here. Um, now the rooftop, the rooftop in, in the Japanese style, they are like going a little bit up. So first I'm going to do the bottom. So I'm not going to do the top one yet. So I first need to know, it's basically not like it's a ceiling, because this is not really a ceiling. This is not something you're going to see if you're walking under it. But it's just like, this is going to be a look uh, under the rooftop. And I've, so I'm first going to shape in how tall I want to have this. So I still see the puppet here. So I'm just going to guess a little bit or what the size of this rooftop should be. And I think that this is okay. I'm not so sure. I think this is okay. And then we're going to push this down. And I need to have a little bit smaller grid. There we go. And also we're going to size this one up there. So now we have like, um, let me put this a little bit in the middle here. I will keep the puppet for now till I am happy with all the sizes. And um, if I think like, okay, that is like the way how, how I go for. Okay, so now that we have like do this in mirror. Now you like, the thing is like with, with, the, with the rooftop, it has, you can also, mirror it the other way like you also have like this side right here and 
Sadly, we cannot do that in Dreams, except we cannot like add more mirror modes inside the same sculpture, which is kind of sad, but it is how the engine works. Um, so we have to, um, yeah, we can only like go with one side of the mirror. But I kind of wish that we, <laughs> we had an option to also to mirror the other way around. That would be so much easier and even faster with, uh, with sculpting. But I mean, it's Dreams, so it's already pretty fast, right? <laughs> and I'm talking longer than I'm actually sculpting, so uh, I'm not often doing this type of videos, but I think it may be fun for people to see how I sculpt. Okay, now um, what I'm going to do is hope. Oh, 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 what happened? What happened? What happened? What, what, what happened? <laughs> this is this is typical Jekta. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. Um, so now we have like, um, um, we're going to make like a sort of ceiling. I don't know what it's called. Like it's, it's like, it's under the rooftop basically. Um, and these are like the supports. And to bring that a little bit with the same as that one. Should be. I think we need to go a little bit smaller with this one. Yep. And I put that on this side here. And also see that this one is not really in the same spot there. And now I'm going back into the normal grid size again, and then I'm gonna copy this. So I reach the other side. There we go. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. And this is something I have to look if everything is looking okay. That we're in the same range. I think this is it. There we go. So that's basically our supports that we're going to bring. Um, I think that we, wait, I think we do need, um, yes, I'm not really like, um, like sometimes people in the chat when I'm streaming in dreams, people often think that I am attacked or anything I'm not <laughs> I do know some building how building works but I'm definitely not an architect I, I wanted to do, to do that. I have been thinking about it uh, I'm not going to lie I've been thinking to be an architect but um, I know it's not easy to be that like you have to have to know math and stuff like that and <laughs> um, yeah definitely something that I do not uh, okay so now we have basically the supports on the front um, and I'm going for like a different style in like in the um, how it looks underneath and I do that with the cylinder so we have here a cylinder and we make the cylinder more as possible like so and the cylinder is not like completely round but it's uh, it has a little bit like this kind of shape so we're going to push it one more time down I'm stamping it already in the scene and now we can like place it somewhere and I think this is the moment for me that I'm going to uh, remove the grid snap and we need a precise move for this because the um, like the roof, like uh, what I said, like um, no, we can we can do this one still. Never mind. Got what I said. <laughs> like the thing that I want to do is it comes later. Um, I'm not sure if we can get like the same position as this one. Yeah, we can do that. Fine, I guess. 
Try to make it like it's connecting so it's like not going to be too heavy on for dreams. Uh, another thing is that I'm going to remove this by the way. Another thing that I always keep in mind is the graphics. Because like I do not want like the puppets already cost like a lot, but like we are still in the one percent graphic range. My rooftop is going to be hopefully one percent. I I'll maybe Maybe I'm going to reach 2% if I'm considering to do the rooftop apart from the supports. Uh, I often do that sometimes because like uh, the supports of course have different, um, how you say that, like different uh, uh, materia. But maybe I will make it out of one sculpt. Okay, so now what we have to do is... Um, is make is is to know where can we go from um, like how large and how deep the roof is going to be. So without going further, I'm going to copy this one, flip it already to the other side, and or maybe we can do actually we can do this. I think that will work. And life clone. And boop. And put it. Around. This is this is always. Uh, oh. Oh, I should not. I should. I should not touch that one. I think. Um. Does that work now? Still? Because I got disabled it. Okay. So, phew. It's still working. So like this is like something that you can do if like this is like the only way to do um. Um, stuff like this, so you have like the other side is also sculpting for you um, Because like you put it on clone um, So this is like Instead of like doing mirror you can do a stuff like this. So it will speed up your uh, your progress a little bit um, And definitely we need that for the rooftop so okay, we need... Was it eight? Or was it? Or was it four? Wait. Was it even higher? Okay. Apparently, like we are not not really on the grid for some reason. Um, sometimes I always get a little bit confused about how grid works. It could be that. Okay, now it's on grid. No. No. This one is not. This one is not. Because we're not getting into. Okay, I have to redo this one here. And like I said, this is going to happen a lot. <laughs> um, I always try to go for the one one grid because like it's easier. So boink. there need to be a two two of a gap, basically. Maybe I should count. Maybe counting is maybe the... the solution. Like, it's really hard to tell. This should be it, right? Because, like, they are now on the edges of the... Uh, not really. Okay, let me see. <clears throat> How can we make sure that, like, it's, um, and that's a question that I'm often asking myself. <laughs> I need to do something. 
I need to do something for myself because like, I, I really do not know how many clones do I need. So I'm going to do this. So like this snaps to the other one. This snaps to the other one. That should be, this should be, like the top one, that should be the one that we need, so. That's, that's the one that we have to match with. That's probably an easier, probably an easier way to do this. I don't know why. Why is this a different? Is it, am I getting crazy? Oh. I see. I see what was going on. Okay. We were not really against the grid. Of the of the one one grid. This should be on on one on one grid. So if I clone now this one here, it should be now. This, this should be it, I think. And then we need, of course, one. Um. Okay, yeah, we're not going into... Um, It's very funny, like sometimes how how the whole snapping progress works. <laughs> but this, uh, this is going to be look okay. So we have to connect these parts already with each other. If my calculation is correct, and it's not, <laughs> how is this po how is this possible? Do I have to go back to the one one grid? Here it's it's also not really. We're not getting in the center of this object here. Okay, so maybe... I'm going to do a little bit... I'm going to do different, guys. I'm, because, like, for some reason, I can't get... <laughs> I cannot get with the clones for some reason. And it's... Like, there should be two... Like, now it's like, see? Now, it, now it's good. So two, so we need this, then delete this one. I know it's a little bit like, um, and delete the, like normally you would do like, um, hey, like normally you would do, um, like fast cloning.
But that doesn't, for some reason, doesn't work on the grid, so I cannot do that. But this works fine. <laughs> oh. Three. Delete the middle two. Like normally, like normally you, 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 you would do like, um, what I did before, right? Just like cloning it like super fast and, um, but apparently, oh, but apparently like he doesn't want to go on the grid. Uh, or maybe I'm doing this wrong. Oh. But now it works. We will get there. Middle one. Um, okay, so yeah, we're not we're not getting like like very good in the middle. Maybe I should have worked from the middle to the outside. <laughs> um, so we let's do that basically. Um, sorry guys, this is what I I warned you in the disclaimer. In the beginning of this video that I can sometimes do a little bit different like deleting stuff and things with me is like I'm always um, okay, but we, we, st we have to start from the middle otherwise it's not working so these oh we have to start from here and so we can so we know where to stop basically I'm going to clone this here That one. Delete the two middle points. Clone. Delete the two middle points. Delete the two middle points. Middle points. Middle. And this is how I build rooftops and stuff. <laughs> it, maybe it's not. I can understand maybe for if it's too boring to watch, or I, I, I hope not. Though I hope it's like very learnful. Um, but this is how I sculpt. This is the way how I do it. So now that we know, we have to stop over there. See, so that's our final stop. So all we have to do is, uh, I forgot to put them, but we can do that separately. Um, yeah, that is, that is already looking good. And maybe you're not already going to see it right at the moment now, but you, you, you're going, you're going to see it. <laughs> Eventually. Now we, we can do this with really. it. Yep. Um so that's that. Um let's close these bars. So here's the thing. Yeah, it's a little bit stupid that I, sh I should have done this a little bit earlier. You can basically speed up this progress by already putting this together. So you have to be sure you don't have to do that. And the fun part is, even though this isn't cloned from the other side, but the fun part is, if you're eventually going to decide to have the Water or smaller, you can you can just like do this and put this inside. So you have a smaller uh, rooftop. 
So that's like that's like a little bit of techniques you can do, right? So because like you're still in a cloning position, um, so he can do stuff like that. I'm not. I think that this is kind of the size that I need. I'm not sure. Um, that's why I start with the puppets. Um, okay, so now that we have this, and I'm looking also at my graphics, two percent. That's a lot. That's already too much. Um, I'm always tapping so we reach one percent again. Um, so there we go. Um, so now what you have to do is we have to close um, uh, what, what's underneath, basically. And so we're going back into scope. Um, I'm going to use um, the, the what is it called the the sphere, sorry the cylinder. And starting from the middle point, and I will stretch this one out. So it needs to match the bottom. I'm not sure if I go for this, by the way. Um, but I have to see how this is going to turn out. Stretch it a little bit further so that, this, that the underneath part is just touching. And that looks fine by me. So now we're going to stretch this over here. Oop. Just like so. Um, I'm always checking if it looks good or not. It doesn't. So, oh. so we have to. Here. This is something that you have to play around a little bit. And again, I have not created something like this ever before, so it's for me completely trial of high stuff. Dreams. Come on. Come on, dreams. Come on. Don't don't be don't be like this to me. I don't know why it's not doing that. I don't know why I cannot grab the sides. There we go. And now we need to make sure that it's a little bit more covered. That seems about right. Okay, so we have now the bottom, basically. So if we select this one. Um, I will flip it so you can see uh, what we have done so far. So what we have done, we, we made the, the spouse in between, the, the, the supports, basically. And, um, and then we basically uh, put a plate underneath uh, that service okay it looks fine I mean there's could be still improvements still uh, I could use um, what I can also use instead of a cylinder we can of course also use a cube um, but I thought like maybe for the roundness a little bit so like it's not completely um, straight but let's see how this is looks. So let's see how this looks. If we're doing the cube. Uh, closing this one down. Whoa! Dreams uh, didn't want to let me place this. <laughs> Whoa, what was that about? Okay, um, this one needs to go up again. The 
the music that you hear in the background is uh, music that's going to be played in Aria. It's one of those reasons. Stamp. Okay, that's like 2%. 3% now. It's going to be a big boy. Thing is, I cannot do more than two percent. It's going to look a little bit. Um, I mean, we don't have to look at from this close. It's got to be in big boy. I wonder if it's because of this clone here. But if we're going to do like this, is that? Less. Let me see. No. No, it's the same. It's it's really the same. Okay, I was maybe thinking that maybe the clone was doing extra graphic. Um, but like, ooh, we were already, and I'm not even that far. <laughs> uh, we were just in the beginning of the roof, and I'm already hitting like, I'm already scratching the two percent graphics thermo. Which is um, worrying, worrisome uh, for me. But it depends where this is leading to. Um, okay, so what we need to do now is now that we have the bottom underneath, and I think that. I'm not sure if this would have to stick out a little bit more. Um, I don't know, but we will, uh, oh, okay, for some reason this plate, I went a little bit too much on this one here. have to overlap left now a little bit more out oh half okay no, no. okay I could increase it a little bit <laughs> uh it's fine by me okay so Now that we cannot have like more degrees in the um, in 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 the um, what is it in the grid size, like the rooftops are not like this in Japan. Um, they are um, they 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 uh, are in a curve, and also they are um, uh, what it's called like they're lower, so they're very f they're almost flat. Like they're almost flat rooftops. Uh, rooftops. Uh, uh, not all of them. Some have like some temples have like a very uh, tall, tall rooftops. It really depends the style. Like there are so many different styles. Um, so we cannot really use grid snap anymore. But I'm going to try to use it with precise move. Now this is going to be uh, a lot tricky. So I know that this is like uh, what is it, like 45 degrees. So. Um, I will make it. I think this is okay. See the. Um, this is fine. I think I can work with this here. Okay. And, and now I need to close this down. No, that's not working like that. Um, how else, what else can we do? I think I'm going to use um, a triangle shape. Well, we don't we don't have a triangle shape, but I think I have to do that in here um, to to close it. And also, I can already make this a little bit more together. And I'm not going to touch them because we we're building something on top of it. But I do need. I do need to fill this gap, and the reason why I do have to to fill that gap is also because um, because.
because I have to cut it eventually. <laughs> I have to make the shape. Um, but this is not. This is definitely not going to be the shape of the roof, right? This is definitely not going to be the shape. Um, and also the rooftop continues further here. So I think I'm going to back into grid snap and I need to use a different. I think the wedge is um, something that we can use for this. Um, I think. I, I do not know. Are we in the same? No, no, we are in the same. Um, cannot do it with grid snap either because like we already. Um, start from the Almost. Switch this out a little bit so I can. the whole thing from here and shape it damp it okay how are we doing so far two percent oh man I was afraid of this <laughs> I don't think we can do the one percent really well with all the, the details that we're putting in here uh, I really was afraid of that and I don't want to like do it in multiple scopes as well because I have reasons for that. Um, all right, so the shape that I'm talking about, I will show that later. Uh, but first, we need to um, do the other side as well. Let me uh, refresh the shape. Start from small again. And now we have have to do is this is so one thing. I don't know how we're going to achieve this. Like I said, never done it before. <laughs> and like if you're doing it in multiple sculpts, it's easier. Right, because like you are um because then you can place them where you want. Oh I don't think we can put it like that. Mm -hmm. I need to think I really need to think how I'm going to achieve this. What is the pyramid doing? Is the pyramid going to help us? Yes. I think maybe the pyramid definitely the one that could help us oh 
Although, we need an extra point, basically. I, I need to have, like... That point. I do not really worry about whether like how it looks underneath because like we can still um, change that. I've never really used the pyramid shape before. So I'm just guessing a little bit of if this is going to help me. <laughs> um, definitely not the shape that I want. Like we have like here a, a very hard corner. I'm sure if we can. I think that I'm I miss kinda an extra point to realize this. But I hope I can prove myself wrong. Um. Maybe. I do not know. <laughs> I really wish that, like, um, yeah, what I can do maybe is using um, a square and then cut it. That is an option to do. Because I'm not really sure if I would go for this technique. Uh, and I think that we cannot shape corners anymore once we have stamped it so that's definitely not a very um, efficient way to do this like we, we can like do still this but that's all we can do once stamped in the world you're screwed and also this corner doesn't make any sense because the Japanese roof doesn't have those corners. Um, oh. So what I'm thinking is maybe to use a uh, square. Let's see if we can just like cut it the way, same way that, almost in the same way what we had. Let's see if that is. I don't know why I'm now starting with the other side, we need this way. Starts from there. And it's very small, so it doesn't have to be that far away, I think. Like it's it's almost like it's 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 closed down the sides. Let's see if we can cut it with this. <laughs> um I hope so. Really do hope so. Have to 
be careful not to touch. Okay, um, I will stamp it, but we do need to size two. Um, was it 20? Almost. That's a little, uh, that's a lot better. Um, definitely a lot better. I'm not sure. Like, if we may, what we also can do is um. Try something else. Uh, I'm going to like make the roof up a little bit smaller, but I'm I'm already cutting the co the corners here. I think maybe that's uh, a little bit better too. So let me first cut the front. So, precise. Um, almost. <laughs> we still have some, like, edges going on here. Now we can morph that away with later on with the skull because we can do that. Um, so probably we're not going to see that anymore anyway. Um, but I kind of want to do it as clean as possible. Um, I don't like sloppy work. I think we should maybe not make the cube. Covering the whole. It's a little bit tricky work. Not going to lie. But I do not really see another solution right now to do this. How are we going? Is it really not in the same? We're not in the same. That's why. Doom, doom. Yikes! <laughs> Should have maybe done this in the beginning while we are doing this. So I could like do this bar on top of the cutting.
Let's remove the precise and completely manual. Um, so it doesn't have to be this far. Scopes. Um, can I ah. don't understand like how that one Um, wait, what? And also just to... I didn't need that small one? Or... I have no idea what I'm doing then. <laughs> oh, we we do need it. I do need it because like No, I do need it. <clears throat> I cannot otherwise do it. I, f I believe. I, I have to cut this down in order to... I really have to do it manually, and I'm not a big fan of doing that. <laughs> it gives it keeps giving me that big difference in the um, so I'm so quiet at the moment like I'm really in focus modes I'm also thinking what I can do better it's it's really this one I like it's I don't know how to fix this one to be honest So close, but yet so far. <laughs> How can I get? I mean, like I can like cut a new one. I mean, that is a solution. That is a solution. It's 
not one of my most beautiful solutions I ever did, but it's definitely a solution. I'm going to put like this one. Delete the two middle. Now we need to make sure the whole structure is connecting to that as well. There we go. Um, oh, what's going on here? Oh, right. That is, of, that is of course, the... Um, do we need this? Yeah, we do still need it, so I have to make this smaller. There we go. And this also looks a little bit flipped. Go. And the plate underneath. To connect. Okay. I think. I think I kind of done it. Now this part, I do not really care that this not, not like look so beautiful, but we're going to make a, um, um, I don't know how it's called, but like it's, it's decoration on top of it. So we, you're not seeing that. Um, yeah, I, I'm fine with this. I don't know how else I would make it. Able to uh, I think it's fine. I think I think we can we can work with this. Um, okay, so that's done. And the reason why I filled in the inside as well is if we're going for a um, cylinder shape again, and we're going to stretch that cylinder shape. Put it a little bit sideways. Um, yeah, we definitely need North Kaleidoscope. Uh, we need Precise too for this to adjust the shape of the roof. And that's why I filled in the inside as well, so we, you can shape the um, like the curve that you always see in those rooftops. There we go. And now you already see that now it's have like that curve shape basically, and we have to do that same way in the font as well. Um, starting with the grid, just to make sure. Then I'm switching back to, oh, that doesn't work like that. Okay, that doesn't work. Like it does this. <laughs> uh, what I can do is Place it in grid, and then I can adjust this. Adjust. Thank you. 
place it already. I can uh, just this. And now we have the, um, the shape already. How long are we already in this uh, in this video? I'm already like an, an hour in. So it took me an hour <laughs> to shape the roof. Um, but I think that like it's um, the outcome is okay. Uh, we definitely need to uh, um, do this side in the support as well. So what that means is, um, yeah, we have to make a cross planes basically. 2%, yeah, that's something that I was afraid of because that was going to happen, um, something like that. Uh, we, I still need to tweak a little bit here, because, like this still here looks a little bit off to me. So we need to make sure that the line is actually going to the edge of the corner. okay that looks fine okay let's do the top and I will keep still in the cylinder mode but not in the cutting and oh all oh, right yeah that's because like we still you know, mirror it um do 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 can i still say now like i don't want to have it cloned anymore Needs to be top of here. Close this down. Stamp it. An hour in, and we're not even close to to the finish part. Like we're not even close to the decorating. I'm. I was already afraid that we would like, yeah, extending the quality. Um, I was afraid that that was going to happen. Okay, why is it the other side? Weird. Losing so much quality. I don't think I can ever go back to the 1% without losing. This is 1%. <laughs> yeah, that lose that is losing a lot of quality. Um yeah, it's a shame. I really wish I could like go lower with this, but apparently not. So this I can probably not put it into my boot. <laughs> Um, which is weird because like, oh, wait a minute, I put it, oh, Let's see what I did here. That's what I did. Now it's at least 1% less. That was what I was doing with it, apparently. Boop, 
And, and now what you all need to do is just like decorate stuff. Um, and I'm totally doing this on my own feeling. So this is not representing anything as in the original uh, or Is it too far from? Is it? I don't know if it's too far out. I, I, I really love how I did not do anything like the same. They can they can stick out a little bit because like you have to connect them. Eventually. But I think that this is maybe you know we can we can do it like this. Totally fine. Totally fine. A bit boring, maybe this part. Okay, it's good. All right. Wait. Huh? No, it's not good. <laughs> not. And we don't even have. Painted it yet, and like put more de the decoration stuff like that. There's so much more work needs to be done on this one. I am thinking to maybe cut this uh, in half as well, so it so we could easily. Clone it on the other side. Like so. Okay, I think that is like um, I'm not only sh I'm not only sure about these uh, about these rings. I mean, they are like this, but I think I need to do a little bit more. Um, a little bit more cleaner. So with that, I mean, I'm gonna go for a little bit like this. So tap them. Almost looks like a sausage, right? Because of it's in the same scope, we cannot select them all together and do this. That's I think that's a little bit more cleaner look to this, so it's not really sticking out that much, and it feels more part of the building. Now, what you can do is um, you you can say like I do not like to have that temp 
that that many so you can say like I want to do this and I mean it's a possibility to, to do so like your it's 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 a free choice of your design um but that, that's something that you can uh, definitely do let's say like I want to like that's the center point of that whole thing right but you can you can design the whole roof yourself um, if you're going to scope something like this. Okay, now what we're going to do is I'm going to build the sideways um, like the curves here. So I'm going for the cylinder and um, I was thinking like should I go for like a curve tool? Cur curve tool is easier. <laughs> Definitely easier, but that's not how they look over there. So we have to do it like one by one, basically. And with that, I mean, okay, I cannot do it like this, so we have to use precise move. And luckily for us, we only have to do this on one side because the rest will do its work and now we have to do is I can clone this one and I think if we're doing it right we can just say like this make it a curve oh I already released it that was not smart of me sometimes is a little bit more chance. Um, is the point smaller? I don't really think so. No, they are in the same shape. Uh, oh wow, this looks okay. I think I have to do it manually. <laughs> Let let's do it. <coughs> let's do it manually because like this this will take forever to get the right shape. I will do it manually. So all we need to do is connect them. Like and we're going to place um like what we did here, we're going to also place it on those things. I mean you you can use curve tool if you want, like if you're want to go a little bit more on the round shapes you can of course use um, curve tools I would not suggest to do that to be honest especially not with this uh, type of building um, something like I would not suggest to do that but again it's your freedom of creativity but I kind of want to keep also the respect of the the building types in the Japanese culture, so I really want to at least let it like it's hey, this is actually a Japanese kind of oh, 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 hey, come on, always battling with this. And the reason why I'm doing it loose is because you, you're you're going to see then the, the little bit of the edges in between, which make us more realistic. Um, so that's why I'm doing that. Again, you do not have to do that. Do -do. And I also need to, um, yeah, to go a little bit in a curve. Like now we're going really straight, right? So I'm going to place one in the corner here, so I know in which direction I should go for. And it should be like 
that. This one can be a little bit smaller. Yep. Top of this, Could be that I just have to do it with uh, without super size, um, but I'm just going to do this a little bit more manually because I s feel that like the precise move wants me to do a little bit <laughs> different placements. Can be take uh, so it can be like a little bit like time consuming a little bit when you're doing this, um, but this does not really look well. Time when I think that I am doing him straight there, going in a completely different. Need some, need some tweaking, but we're getting closer. Maybe curve tool was a good option though, but <laughs> but the thing is with curve tool they are like round round, so um, and I feel that I we can do with the saline a little bit better. In in the, in terms of this, but I, I think that like using a, a, a losing uh, using an, an, um, a curve tool will, will work as well. But I kind of like to have a little bit like the, the roughness in the the shape uh, a little bit. I'm not sure if it's too thick. Is this too thick? But the reason why I'm not like using curve tool with this is because like I do not because like in curve tool is like completely round round and I mean like the shape. And if you're like using Salinas, like it has a little bit of like cuttings, like it's not like perfectly placed. 
and and that will give a little bit more and especially the way if you're um, if you're going to um, paint it eventually you will get that um, old looking style a little bit better you have to see it eventually with the, with the paint of course and in the in the uh, in the end like you can you can you can do go crazy in the end like you can like shape them a little bit like the way how you want Okay, so that is something that we have done. Now, uh, how far are we with the graphics? Two percent. I mean, like we're we're still doing fine with the graphics. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> Two percent is uh, as long as we're not exceeding three percent, to be honest. But like two percent for the rooftop. And okay, so what we need to do now is like we need to put the um, the tiles, right? You have like. Um, now there are many different tiles you can make. You can make them out of bamboo. You can make them out of like uh, plates or anything. Like there's like really different types of um, of these sculptures you can do, or like or the roof, these rooftops that you can do. Now I I will go for um, like for normal tiles basically. So they are like um, normal tap tiles. But you can here we have so many different shapes and types. But for this one, I go for the normal one. Um, yeah. So, and I think I think the curve tool is a perfect way to do the the, um, the in between supports. Um, so I'm go just going to use the curve tool this time. And I'm not sure if yeah, well, should, uh, maybe I should start with grid. Then we can always change that later on if you want. Um, how many do we need? That is, like, that is the question. Basically. Go straight. Like so. Yeah, to be honest, this was a little bit faster to do that with the other one. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Um, <laughs> definitely faster to do it with this. Okay. I'm going to blend them a little bit, like, as much as possible into... So here, and I'm probably going to end up with a cylinder in the front. This looks fine by me, so I'm going to stamp it in this place. Um, nah, it's not really that perfect. I can maybe wait. Let me move the mirror thing so I get a little bit away with that. Um, okay, I think I'm going to redo it because I was not really happy with. how it blended in the roof. I think this it's really hard to tell because like you're you're dealing with shadow. I think like this. Better. Okay. 
And now we have to clone this. And you have to make sure like how many times do we need this. So what the best thing to do is, is just start from the middle point. So we know where to stop. No, oh, did I remove the mirror? Oh. It's back now, right? Yeah. The thing is that like I really want I wa wanted to get rid of the um, the sc mirror screen, but <laughs> I turned off the complete mirror. Wow, that was uh Okay, so now we have to find a little bit of like, okay, where can we put an thing that is around here? Like this gap, maybe a little bit smaller. Maybe like this, so. And then. Clone it. But clone it so. That we know that at least like. They have a bit of the same. No! <laughs> Why is Dreams always doing that? Like, if you release, it, it will always go in really weird ways. I don't know what's going on in. What is this here? Is that. Oh! That's this one. It's not. Oh. Interesting. Interesting. Apparently, my cylinder is not perfectly placed. Oopsie daisy. Maybe I'm considering to maybe redo this as well. Um, I am considering to do that. I need to. Okay. It, it looks now. Uh, that has like not like all the same stuff. It's fine. Like that's feels more natural. So I'm I'm not completely unhappy with that. I need to redesign the curve here. Um, let's see if I can do it. The thing is, is that with the curve tool, you only have certain points that you can stretch out with, and I do feel that we have to get an option to add more points, so you can go a little bit more precise, especially like in the corners, like here. But we have to to do have to do what we have. So, uh, let's go what we have. I cannot really... What is with this cylinder? Why is he doing... Not... Linda replaced this having its own adventure. I'm having it now. It's so many trial and error, basically, with this. So, sorry about that. Okay. One more time. Probably not. Probably not. Seems like 
seems like it. Stamp. Okay, this looks, uh, I think this looks fine. So now we can clone this. A few times. does look... It looks like it's not maybe same in the same thing, but like maybe you can do it a little bit better. Maybe I can switch to the one one. It'll make my life a little bit easier, I think. That will make my life a lot easier. Okay. Now I can do one thing. I can or remove this completely, this one, or we can try to cut it. <laughs> and I think I'm going to remove it. But we definitely need here another one. We cannot, we cannot do, we cannot go without. So, what? I did not place it. Okay, having a little bit of uh, issues with dreams at the moment. I had it on eight, right? I need to place it in the exact same spot. Hopefully this will work, what I'm going for. Do -do -do. Kind of works. You only have to make sure that, like, it's not crooked and it's crooked right now. That is the correct line. Okay. That should be it. It's also over there. Good, maybe, um, I think I'm going to redo this one here. Uh, because of it. <laughs> uh, I can leave this one, that's fine. See if this um, will look a little bit better. I can always like do um, make it so that like it looks like cut. I think that's better. I think 
that's a lot better. So now we have the, um, those things as well. And the only thing I, what I can do is still to make that it looks like it's, um, decorate this. Let's make this a little bit. The only thing is that with the curve tool, is like, and it's not only with the curve tool, it's of course with, like, with every skill, almost, that you bend or you, you cannot like change the, um, the the outcome anymore. And I wish we could do that, but I maybe also understand that it's like not like that because because of the way how this works. So you have to do it right, as in, you, you cannot make a mistake. <laughs> it, it needs to go well, like the, the, the very first time you're doing this, otherwise you have to redo it and... I think this looks okay, but I do not sure, but... Uh, oh no! Oh well, that's because like this particular thing was not in the right place. Um, let me use the size. Try to make it match. Okay. And that is like the shape on this side. So we did that. Um, it probably needs some some tweaks here and there. Like it's it's. Um, yeah. Let, let's that's safe by the way. And Japanese food. Japanese food. Need some hydration. Alright. Let's continue. What is the time right now? How many? Almost two hours. <laughs> I, I remember I said in the beginning of this video I will I will I will aim for the one hour sculpt. <laughs> oh man! Yeah, I knew that this was going to happen. It will take some time, but this is how it looks if you have both sides. And it's not done yet. We still need some tiles in between, um, and we are at two percent still. So I think that's uh, still good. I guess I, I don't think we can go lower anymore. Um, let's see how it looks with the puppets still, and I think that this is, uh, yeah, well, we started with the puppets, so this should be fine. Yeah, this is totally fine, especially for what we're going for. Um, I, I don't think we can go lower anymore, at least not without losing. Oh, we can! <gasps> this was 1%. Okay, even though, like, we're losing quality, but to be honest, like, you're going to see this from this distance, I think, I think it's not bad. Um, I mean, like, we're not going to see this from a close, especially not if you, if you have like painted. Like, we, we go. The fun part is still going to be, going to happen because like painting will 
it's always the fun part to do because that will be like it's going to make your scope to life and yeah um okay so we also need to do this side as well and let's go into it and let's see because like I'm a little bit stupid that I Um, I'm doing one, no, I was like doing one in the middle, but that's maybe not so smart to do. I'll just do this. And see how it will look eventually. But yeah, curve tool is, uh, is definitely an answer for this. I was not really sure first to use this curve. I'm not, I mean, like curve tool is pretty nice, though. I'm, I'm I'm not going to say that I do not like curve. I often use curve in different situations, but I wasn't really sure if I should have done this also in the. I think um, Oh, that is right. Yeah. I have to do them manually. Oh. The reason why I have to do it manually is because <laughs> I cannot cut it because I can send in the same scope. This is all the same scope. And like I said, I have reasons for that. To build everything in one scope. That is, of course, to save some uh, resources. Sometimes it's really hard to see if you are in a in a straight line, and it, my my eyes says no, no. But uh, I think we are not in a straight line. That's that should be the straight line. Huh? Oh. I think this is okay. I think this is okay. Stamp it in place. <laughs> um, that's also something that I really want to fix. It's this side here. Um, I don't know how I should have done that a little bit different. Uh, okay, but we're not done. We need another one here. I think I'll go for three in total. Um, I 
think that's just enough. Try to blend as much as possible in it. Okay, I think I'm done. I think I'm uh, done. I hope so, at least. <laughs> Uh, at least, like, is this the worst part? I'm not really sure if this is the worst part of the whole structure to do. Um, okay. So what we're going to do now is, um, we're going to finish the, um, the decoration in the end tops. And with that, I mean, we need cylinders. So we go back to cylinder. You can also reuse, um... We yeah, use real no we didn't really use the cylinder here. So go for the cylinder. <clears throat> because now we have to close like to finish them off, basically. In this particular size. So it looks like they are part of that whole um, curve, right? And now we only need to Am I still in mirror mode? I got so scared. I I'm not <laughs> I was really afraid that because that that I saved it and I closed the the thing and that I forgot to enable the mirror mode again. <laughs> wow, I really got scared for a moment. I I I really got scared. Okay, this one looks a little bit odd, but I can like change that maybe in a little bit. Anyway. And it should Kinda ish. There we go. Now we have a nice um, thing there. And I think what I'm going to do is just with. Not with the kaleidoscope. With <laughs> the size move. We're going to tweak a little bit of the mistakes that I see here. So it's actually just like. Nice. Fitting boards. Mm, I think that's it. Yep. All right. And because it's bigger, because of this is the one side, you can just like flip it around and then we have like two sides this is how it will look now this is how the Japanese house looks uh, like building looks um, <clears throat> now there is probably going to be um, for the sake of this roof like like you can also have like that this is going to be having a hollow inside um, and I will show you that like which you, you can do stuff like this as well if you are not happy that like the roof that, that the whole thing is flat you can do this like so So you have a little bit of like a hollow kind of uh, thing. So if you're if you're planning to to have maybe something like um, a, a rooftop that is like a, 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 um, under a an, an structure or anything, or uh, you can make it hollow inside as well. Um, 
but that that's I would like I would say like you you can basically go a little bit nuts with the way how you want to design this, but you have to be careful. Like there are some points in the like especially here that reaches the the sides, so you have to be careful with this. Just to show you a little bit of what you can do. Uh, oh, it looks fine. And you can also like go with the supports a little bit further. So you can say like I want to have the supports go also in in this kind of shape. So you have to use maybe the curve tool. Um, but I don't really need this. At, at least not with this. But this particular um, uh, with this particular roof because. Um, um, because like the reason why not is because I will place this on top of my boot so you're going to see the, I hope if it can fit if it's not going to be exceed the three percent or anything it's still one percent so I'm very happy but like if it's like um, more than two percent I cannot probably not going to place in the boot because like I'm already almost close to the max um, but yeah, this is something that I'm not going to do with this one here. But I, I can always like remix this and use different shapes and um, sizes and colors and um, at least like we have now like the, the base shape of the roof, as you can see. Um, and yeah, I really had to like in the beginning a little bit like figuring out like how can I approach this roof. The best way possible since I've never done something like this before so I had like to look at like okay how can I make this um, the way how I want <laughs> um, but like it looks fine um, I have not really any complaints so far okay and um, we are still on 1% so I'm totally happy with that I remember that when we were doing uh, in, I think in like an hour before we were having three percent, right? So that was like that was scary because like I was like, if that's going to happen already, then I'm not going to be able to put this into um, my boot. Okay, so we also need the supports on the other side as well. So we're going to do that, and now it's adding one percent extra. That is funny. Why is that? Oh, that is because, like, we have a clone here. Dreams, you scared me. <laughs> you, you really scared me a lot. Um, I already thought I was, like, exceeding the, um, the limitations. So, now we also have those sights. And now we, we can, like, do this again. And now we know how it looks. Um, I could make one more here. I think that's possible to do. Um, but I'm also like, nah. I'm happy how it is. <laughs> I I don't think that I need that, to be honest. I think I'm happy how it is. Um, I don't think that we need too much supports in the front for this. Um, no. I'm 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 happy with it. Okay, so the final, not the final, but like the um, the the thing that we have to do next now is like we're hitting the two hour mark. So I'm not sure if I will keep recording and then like uh, uploading and everything, or just like stop here and then the next section, then the next uh, maybe the next two hours. <laughs> um, so. If it's the end of this video, then thank you so much for watching. Um, I really hope that you enjoyed how I sculpt this Japanese roof top. Um, so, um, yeah, now you know a little bit more how I'm sculpting. And also know how uh, I do things and redo things if I'm not happy with stuff. Um, yeah, I really hope that you enjoyed. Um, and if you really want to know how this is going to look further, uh, there will be, of course, uh, another video and that I'm finishing this. And maybe it's in the same video. I do not know. But I think I will cut it in two parts. Okay, uh, thanks so much for watching and see you next time in the next video. Bye-bye for now.